So Sonic Mania has been out for a few weeks now, and though I've been enjoying it immensely, the one thing that I was looking forward to other than the game itself was proper 4-3 aspect ratio support. During the lead-up to the game's release, several people had asked Christian Whitehead via his Twitter if 4-3 support was going to be a thing, and he said, and I quote, Yes, you can set the engine to run at 4-3, you'll just see less play area left and right, of course. Ha <laughs> ha. Now this seemed to indicate that we were indeed going to be getting native 4.3 aspect support, and I was looking forward to playing Sonic Mania on my old school CRT television set. Upon release, however, it turns out that while the game does indeed support 4.3 resolutions, they are all locked to 16 by 9 aspect ratio. This means that if you pick anything other than a widescreen resolution, you get big black bars on the top and the bottom of the screen. So, being slightly disappointed, I ghettoed a less than ideal 4.3 alternative for my TV. I simply matched the game window to the height of my CRT's vertical resolution, and then centered the game on the TV itself. This meant that while the game was visibly running in 4.3, it was still rendering the far right and left of the screen. For the most part though, this is perfectly playable. The standard gameplay was based on the original 4.3 Sonic game, so running around stages aren't affected in the slightest by the missing screen real estate. Heck, it's even apparent that 4.3 was once on the cards, as many menu elements, such as the save game screen, crop perfectly at 4.3 without overlap or cutoff sections. Since I've beaten the main game, I can literally give three notable instances where this became a problem. The first is the main menu. This is one of the only menus in the game, though, that doesn't seem to play nice with 4.3. Most other menus crop almost perfectly to 4.3, without anything being cut through or anything missing from the middle of the screen. The second is the secret TV in the beginning of Studioopolis. With the left of my screen being cut off, I didn't even know it was there until a friend pointed it out to me while watching my stream. The final problem is that there are a couple of boss fights that use the edges of the screen as hazards. The only one that I can think of, thinking back, is the Robotnik Spider Boss. During the fight, at the edges of the screen, there are walls of spikes that whiz past the camera. These spikes are near invisible without the edges of the screen. I was still able to see where they were from the tips of the spikes, but they were very easy to miss if you weren't paying attention. Apart from these issues, 90% of the game is perfectly playable even in Cropped 4.3, to the point where I was even able to beat the game without any other problems other than the ones I've mentioned. But of course, I wasn't satisfied. I needed actual native 4.3 support. So after searching around, I managed to find this post from a user on 4chan, which states, just popping by to inform anyone interested in playing the game in 4.3 aspect ratio mode, if you use a cheat engine or hex editor and edit the address 00639b4c to a value of 320, the game will adjust its camera and HUD elements to accommodate for a 4.3 play. So, of course, I went to try this. Unfortunately, Sonic Mania has been updated since that was posted, and so the memory addresses have shifted with the update meaning that that memory address no longer corresponds to the aspect ratio. Darn. But, after digging around, I did manage to find where the address currently is, and... Boom. There it is. Actual 4.3 support. So how do the previous issues noted with the cropping method stack up? Well, the first issue is mostly gone. It turns out that Sonic Mania ties most of its HUD and UI elements to the boundaries of the game window. So enforcing the rendering area to 4.3, it in turn drags those in, making them perfectly visible. The pause menu is perfectly visible with all of it dragged into the middle. Even the zone titles, which previously were fully visible in Cropped, have the Sonic Mania logo in the top right hand corner pulled in so it's no longer sticking off the edge of the screen. Literally the only thing in the menu system that is still a problem is the absolute main menu with the four options to start the game. This is still cropped. But not only is it still easily visible to see what all the options are, from an actual game depth perspective, it would be a simple fix to just scale these down or move them in. The second and third issue are also gone completely. With the camera now rendering a 4-3 aspect ratio, it has more space to move to the end of a stage, which means that it can pan with Sonic to show the boundaries just like it could before, both in normal stages and in boss fights. So the TV in the beginning of Studioopolis is now visible and fully accessible without taking a shot in the dark. The bosses, such as the spider robotnik, have the camera panned to the right and the left so that you can easily see the spikes while fighting the boss. And as someone who has beaten the game in Cropped 4.3, these were the only issues I encountered. And they're pretty much all resolved with native 4.3 rendering. So why don't we have 4.3 as an option in-game? 
Retro Engine seems to support it natively, which makes sense since it was originally designed for recreations of the original Sonic games. The boss fights aren't affected by it, which is one of the biggest hurdles I initially thought was a problem with it. And the only thing that seems to need adjusting is the scaling of the absolute main menu. Hopefully enough people will want this to the point that Christian or other dev members will patch it in in a future update. But, for now, you can do this yourself by downloading Cheat Engine and using the save I have in the description which has the memory addresses. All you have to do is make sure the game is running, change all of the values to 320, go back into the game, and apply video options, and your game will be in 4.3. Godspeed, fellow 4.3 fans!